welcome to this lecture in this lecture we are going to study dual space and some related concept like dual basis transpose of linear operator double dual space etc first of all let us see when we talk about a set s which containing linear transformation t from v to w okay notice here that the field is same for both of these vector spaces okay so where t is a linear transformation now if we talk about this collection then uh, this collection on the same field that means this s on the same field is a vector space and this vector space is known as also denoted by uh, l v to w okay space of linear transformation from v to w right now if we talk about the dimension then the dimension of uh, v vector space of linear transformation from v to w is same as dimension of v times dimension of w okay so this is how we can identify the dimension of uh, li linear space that contains linear transformation from v to w okay ab kyunki hum uh, is tarike ke hamesa linear vector spaces bana sakte hain so in that case if we choose this w as f okay we know that w ko agar hum choose kar le f every field is a vector space on itself so in that scenario in that scenario we are considering linear transformations from v to f now okay now this set again will form a vector space vector space and this vector space is no uh, is denoted by v star and this v star is the dual space of the vector space v okay so let us identify some definitions and this is the motivation for linear uh, dual space so let us start the definition of linear function okay so let v be a vector space over a field f okay then a linear transformation linear transformation t from v to f is known as known as linear functional linear functional and let me write it it on v on v this is functional this is the first definition linear functionals as a linear transformation hai jo ki vector space se iske field mein define ho theek hai now we will talk about another definition this is the first definition then we are talking about the coordinate function coordinate function with respect to with respect to the basis beta okay so again let v be a vector space over field f okay and let beta equal to x1 x2 and so on xn b n ordered basis now if we have a ordered basis then we can always talk about coordinate vector okay yahan par hum function uh, definition padhne wale coordinate function ki okay so then 
therefore each x belongs to b we know that there exists some a1 a2 and so on an such that this x can be written as, as a linear combination of x1 x2 and so on xn okay this is the linear combination of these vectors of ordered basis now then which implies that the coordinate vector related to the vector uh, basis beta is a1 a2 and so on a so this is the coordinate vector related to the uh, ordered basis beta then in that case we define we define fi on x is becoming ai where i is running from 1 to n okay is a linear functional abhi humne functional ki definition padhi thi that is a function a linear transformation from a vector space v to its field okay is a linear functional on v called the ith ith coordinate function ith coordinate function with respect to with respect to the ordered basis ordered basis beta theek okay? hai so this is the definition for coordinate vector now you can see in a more precise way agar hum f1 ki baat karenge then f1 at x will give us a1 f2 at x will give us a2 and likewise fn of x equal to a okay now suppose we are having some distinct element y in v then this y will have a coordinate vector like this y of b then here will be suppose b1 b2 bn then f1 8y will be given give us uh, uh, b1 then f2 of y will be equals to b2 so these are the definition for b f1 f2 and fn what is that definition ki each fi will give the uh, image ai for each x okay this kind of x if x is having a linear combination or the uh, coefficient like a1 a2 an then f2 of x will be a2 f1 of x will be a1 and like that aur is tarike ke agar hum sare functional ko dekhenge f1 f2 fn to har ek i ke liye we call this as coordinate function with respect to the ordered base beta now this f2 is known as the second coordinate function with respect to beta this fn is known as nth coordinate vector with respect to ordered basis beta so this is about the coordinate function with respect to ordered basis beta now we will talk about the dual space and then once we have a dual space then we can talk about dimension and its basis so let us start the definition of dual space so again let v be a vector space over the field f and uh, let uh, v star denotes the set of then v star is equal to set of linear transformation from v to f okay then then this space v star is known as is known as dual space now i am writing here dual space 
of v of v और linear functional के लिए हमने क्या लिखा था on v so अगर हमारे पास v एक vector space है तो उस vector space से उसके field में defined सारे linear transformation का collection अगर हम लेंगे तो वो collection ही हमारा dual space होता है so basically we can write here dual basis or oh, sorry dual space contains contains uh, we can say linear linear functional okay linear functionals kya hote linear transformation from vector space to fit ab agar hamare paas uh, ek space hai to we can talk about its dimension and then we can talk about its basis so let us start with the dimension first so dimension of b star so abhi humne dekha that the dimension of here you can see dimension of v w is equal to dimension of v times dimension of v w so we can write the dimension of v star is same as dimension of the space l from v to f okay and this is a same is dimension of v times dimension of f f is filled now filled over filled agar hum is vector space ki baat kare then it's a dimension on f will always equal to 1 so we have as dimension of v dot 1 and that is same is dimension of v so we have that dimension so as we can say dimension of a uh, dual space is same is same is the space or we can say same is space ठीक है सो दिस इज अबाउट द डायमेंशन नाउ सिंस वी हैव द डायमेंशन सो वी कैन टॉक अबाउट इट्स अ बेसिस सो वी आर श्योर कि अगर हम किसी वेक्टर स्पेस v के लिए जो कि फाइनाइट डायमेंशन है अगर वो उसका डायमेंशन n है तो इसका ड्यूअल स्पेस का डायमेंशन भी n होगा अगर इसके ड्यूअल बेसिस का ड्यूअल स्पेस का अगर डायमेंशन n है so we are sure that there will be n elements only in the order or in the any basis of this v star okay so from this fact we are sure ki if v is a vector space whose dimension is n then the dimension of v star that is the dual basis of v will also have dimension n and in that process the any basis of v star will contains n elements only now ye ऑर्डर्ड बेसिस या फिर ये बेसिस किस तरीके से बनेंगे फ्रॉम द ओरिजिनल बेसिस तो इसके लिए हम बात करेंगे ना वी आर कमिंग टू द डेफिनेशन ऑफ ड्यूअल बेसिस ड्यूअल बेसिस लेट वी बी अ वेक्टर स्पेस वेक्टर स्पेस ओवर a field f okay and let b is equal to x1 x2 and so on x and b of b and ordered basis order basis for v then the set of then the set of coordinate coordinate functions related to coordinate functions related related to the ordered basis ordered basis beta that is the set b star which contains f1 
f2 and so on fn is known as is known as dual basis of beta for v star okay so for basis we always use this four so we are writing beta is a basis for v okay we write here for v now this beta star is dual basis of this beta okay jaise humne dual basis ke liye kaha tha that v star is dual basis of v likewise we are saying this beta star is dual basis of this b theek hai this beta and you can write where where fi a of x equal to ai where coordinate of x related to beta is a1 a2 and so on an so this is the coordinate vector agar coordinate vector hai to fi ki means ye hogi for i running in one plane so this is the definition of dual basis of any basis beta in the original vector space v ab ye agar basis hai to v star ke har ek element ko uniquely represent kar sakte hain hum inki form mein या फिर हम ये कहें कि हर एक एलिमेंट को ये एफ एन एफ टू एफ एन ही जनरेट करेंगे तो दोनों बातें सेम ही हैं अगर ये जनरेट कर रहे हैं इसका मतलब एवरी फॉर एवरी एफ सपोज इन वी स्टार वी कैन राइट दिस एफ एज अ लीनियर कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ दीज कोऑर्डिनेट फंक्शंस तो इसी से रिलेटेड जो हमारी नेक्स्ट थ्योरम है वो डिस्कस करती है कि किस तरीके से ये फंक्शंस इस वी स्टार के लिए एक ऑर्डर्ड बेसिस का कंस्ट्रक्शन करते हैं एंड इन दैट केस फॉर एवरी एफ वी कैन राइट दिस एफ एज अ यूनिक लीनियर कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ दिस दिस कोऑर्डिनेट फंक्शंस 